Hello everyone. Today in this video, we will talk about a very important topic for students, graduates and researchers, which, which is male merging. Why it is important to us as a researcher? Let's say we want to contact all professors in our field in order to get scholarship or international collaboration with these professors. Then of course we must send emails to them but you can imagine how much time and effort we will spend if we write to each professor separately. So in this video, we will know how to send thousands of emails, thousands of emails to thousands of professors at once in uh, no more than 10 minutes using email merge. Uh, but first we will learn how to get all emails of target professors uh, some cell like this Excel sheet here, we see the name of professors we want to contact and the uh, second column uh, has emails of the professors. The first thing we want to uh, make this uh, list, uh, we will go to scopus.com. You have to have uh, an account. So if you are Egyptian, uh, the Egyptian Knowledge Bank, uh, bank uh, give you a free account. So here we type the uh, our topic or uh, our field or whatever. Uh, for example, we type here hepatocellular carcinoma, then click on search. See here's the results, document title, the name of the paper, the authors, years, and so on. And here uh, you can refine result. Uh, you can only uh, take all open access paper. Uh, you can only show uh, the uh, papers published uh, in 2021 or whatever. So here we I will only use um for example this one papers in 2019 then limit two i can use it's uh, i prefer to use uh, all papers uh, published in 2021 so it's it will be uh, updated so here i will click on all then cvs export then i use this one and i want uh, the email of corresponding also so uh, i will click here correspondence address then export So here I have more than 2000 emails, so it will take some time. Uh, so Scobus uh, tells you that uh, put your email address and after the process uh, uh, will finish, I will send you email with uh, the Excel sheet. But here I, I will take this one. Papers uh, published uh, uh, have been published in uh, only the 2001st, 2000 the paper to and export, and then it will give me uh, this sheet. I have a previous one, so let's take this one. I think, uh, yes, uh, as we see here, there are the formatting as uh, there's no formatting, you know. Uh, this column, I don't. I want this column, so I will delete it. I only want this column, the corresponding, the correspondence address. The problem here is that, yes, I have all emails, but it's merged with uh, the, the name. I want only the name and the email. So I will separate them from each other. How I, I can do this? Uh, uh, this is, is, is one problem. The other problem is that I have some blank, blank rows. There are some blank rows. There are two problems. Uh, so the first one, 
I will, the first thing I will do is that I will make some formatting. So I will select this one, the, the, this column, and make wrap text. So it will be wrapped like this. As we see here, there are some blank uh, rows. I want to uh, remove or get rid of them. So I will select this one and press F5. Then I will click on special, then blank. What I do here, I select all blank rows. As I see here, all blank rows uh, have been selected here. All blank rows have been selected. To delete them, click Control and minus sign at the same time. Control and minus sign. And click here, Shift cell up, and OK. All blank document, all blank rows uh, uh, have, have been removed. Then I want to uh, uh, separate the name from the email. So the first thing I will select this and go to data and then text to column, then put here, click here, and here other I will type column, then next, then finish. As we see here, I separate, I the, the uh, emails have been separated from the rest of the document, the, of the rest of the uh, uh, affiliation, the affiliation and the name. So the next step is to cut this column and put it here. Why I do this? Because when I make some formatting on this, it will be spread over the next column and delete this one. And I need this one. So I will say next step. I will select this one and press here in data also, take it to column. And this time I need only to separate. I will deselect this one and comma and semicolon. I will separate them from each other here, comma and here semicolon then next, then finish. OK, as we see here, I have the correspondence address, the name of uh, professors, and there are here the first name and the middle name. And all, all this, I, I didn't want all this. So I will delete them. Here, I got what I want the name and the email address. So I will name this one, this colon name, and this one email address or email. Uh, of course, uh, may uh, 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 one professor can uh, or uh, may publish more than one paper at the same year. So uh, I think there are many uh, duplicated uh, names. So uh, I will here, I will press here or select this one and remove duplicate. So I, uh, so that I will not send the same email twice to the same professor. And then I will here, I will remove duplicates. And yes, expand selection, remove all duplicates, and OK. There are, you know, 321 duplicates. So I will remove all of them. And now all are unique. See here, this one, Zing and Zing. And this one, Huang and Huang, this one, Qin and Qin. I just check that there is no error. There are no errors. 
Suda, Suda, and so on. Hoffman, Hoffman. So there, this is the list. I will save it. Control S. I will save this list to use it. So save as. I will save it in the desktop and I will make it Mustafa. Then I will save it as Excel sheet. Save. So I it has been saved. Then to send an email, I, I want here I will send uh, about more than 1,700 emails at the same time. So how can I do this? I will go to mailing, then I will make email messages. So I will select the recipient, use an existing list. Where is the list on the desktop? Where is the list here, Mustafa Bir? Okay. Okay. Then I will add dear professor. Here I want to add the name where I I have here one thousand and seven hundred names. So insert merge fill then. Here is the name. Okay. Comma. Then enter. Then I will add the template. Uh, I, dear professor, whatever, I hope you are doing well. I am Mustafa. and so on lecture of whatever and so on and type the message uh, as you want then best regards here and your affiliation and your email And here you see what you want, uh, what's your qualification, why you choose this uh, professor. Uh, then after you finish here, you send email messages to what's the subject line. You can see, uh, for example, post doc position or whatever or whatever you want and here for the format is html and i want to send to all if you want to select from one to ten or whatever you, you can select only from one to one hundred or from one to, to 15, whatever you want, and OK. And we will see here, you know, see here, all names change it. OK, then send it to uh, the professors. Uh, if you have uh, Outlook, it will open in the Outlook, and you can see all emails uh, uh, has been had been sent. Thank you so much uh, if you like this video and want to see the upcoming coming videos, you can subscribe this channel.